Yo, hi, and welcome. My name is Daniro, and I welcome you back to Let's Play Octopath Traveler. In the last episode, by the way, the last episode was part 100. Woo <laughs> yeah, totally forgot that. And yeah, in this episode, we tried our luck against that man eating plant, which didn't go too well. And yeah, I'm level 55 now, just <laughs> to I don't know because I wanted to because. I wanted to get everyone a few levels because I got my butt kicked in the last part. So yeah, um, I think level 55 should be enough for some other things. Maybe I don't go and attack that plant again. And yeah, I am gonna play this travel banter now before I tell you what we are going to do in this part. My fresh baked bread. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm delicious a crunchy crust soft doughy inside and at the center of all it a dollop of wild strawberry jam gosh honey these are tasty i am happy that they plays in the it make it the effort worthwhile wait you made these don't need us not to look so surprised i was given a jar of rose hip and a strawberry jam then i asked a local tavern keeper if i might have borrowed his oven to us but the work of a morning i wish i knew how to bake the shirt it's nothing but porridge and tag most days i could teach thee if thou wishest truly why that would be splendid what do you call this particular confection sweet though this is a popular treat in my home village frankly i would have never expected you to be such a good cook Wherefore, thinkest thou so? Hunters spend long days and nights out in the woods. It behoved us to know and how to prepare meals, lest we starve in there. Needs must, eh? Well, as my professor always said, necessity is the greatest teacher. Necessity, yes, yet it pleased me even more that others find in my cooking agreeable. Perhaps next time I catch some game, I could make it a stew, seasoned with forest herbs. With wild turnips on the side and an apple sauce, and hey, hey I think Hanit sounds found a new calling. Hmm, all right, uh, I'm walking around with this group because I'm not really sure why. <laughs> and yeah, uh, we're gonna go and do some quests because I found quite a few solutions for some of them. And yeah, we're gonna take care of those. Still haven't found that fencing instructor though. <laughs> and yeah. Let's go and cross every single quest off that we have right now that we can complete. Uh, heave codes, high drinks. I noted everything down on my little list, and yeah, Princess Mary Redox and Prince again. I don't know how to complete those, but yeah, I got heave codes, high drinks. I found Night Eye, who is in Whisper Mill. Uh, Whisper Mill, where's Whisper Mill here? There's a grammar. There's a grammar mistake in my notes. Whisper with H after a W, which is wrong. Yeah. <gasps> Dang it. All right. Um. Was it him? Uh. No. Eve code said someone with an obnoxious laugh, and this guy. Someone around his age and someone with an obnoxious laugh. And yeah. When I speak to him, left? then. <laughs> and yeah, he actually says something about Eve Code. So yeah, that is kind of obvious that <laughs> this guy is the guy that we are looking for. And I just realized I don't have Ophelia to bring this guy with me. <laughs> and yeah. And of course, I tested if this is actually the right person. <laughs> Screaming from above again, thank you. <laughs> and yeah, the way I do that is I take people with me that I think are the right ones, speak to this quest uh, giver person, and yeah. There's a cutscene popping up. I instantly like <laughs> close the game, not even skipping the cutscene or anything. 
just instantly i don't know turning off the game hitting the the home button and stuff because i don't want to skip like the cutscene or anything to see what i get from that or anything yeah and there's a gigantic person walking by my window the whole time <laughs> um yeah all right hi i brought you night eye how long has it been, Heathcote? You've gotten so old. You're not spring chicken yourself. Yet I managed to get in. It appears your skills aren't what they used to be. But it was a struggle to get that far, wasn't it? I doubt you could have gone another step. Or would you rather attribute that to old age hmm, at least your sense of humor never gets old but i'll be the one with the last laugh feed code you'll see i've already won <laughs> my true aim is to get you to see me i knew this would be the perfect chance to take the cat's eye from you you never will out it after all yeah nah. You fell right into my trap. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. He hasn't changed a bit. No, he might not look like much now. He was a notorious thief in the heyday. He and I were rivals in our youth, always aiming for the same treasure. And eventually, the heart of the same woman. She was like a beautiful maiden in a high tower, seemingly out of our reach. So we made a bet: whoever could steal her beloved cat's eye, could steal her heart. Well, our last would have to give up and leave the business forever. I emerged victorious and professed my love to her, but her heart was already set on another. <laughs> that man, eccentric though he may be, as promised, he washed his hands of the business and ran away with her. Hmm. I remember hearing a rumor that she passed away. It makes me wonder if he came to return the cat's eye to its proper owner. My apologies for rambling. Perhaps I really am getting old. Heave coats dagger. All right, it's one quest. Quite a bunch to follow. Are you all? <laughs> Why did they all disappear inside of me now? Uh, Heave coats dagger. I can't see if it's good or not because I don't have a dagger wielder in my group. Anyway, um. I noted all the quests down on like order like those two ogans epilogue would be the next and yeah i know how to complete that one as well i have to go to victor's hollow i think was it right yep i need uh fairy on for that because i need to steal something I can also see if I if the dagger is any good. Hmm, nope. That's a really good magical dagger. Increases fire damage dealt. That's that sounds like something that Virion could need, but it's like a dagger that I would get. If I wanted to make fairy on a magic user, right? Wow. Well, no wonder she isn't doing any damage. <laughs> Her equipment is horribly outdated. Look at that. Finally, if I make a scholar fire damage or a thief, it would do a lot of damage. All right. I think this woman. Try not to be surprised when you hear this, but I've got some rare blooms in today. 
Look at this. Find might me always. I found just the one bloom high up in the mountains. Hey, come on, act like a little impressed. All right, I'm so impressed that you let me steal that from you. And yeah, that is for Ogun. Uh, where was he again? Here, right? Yeah, you wanted those kind of flowers, and yeah, we got them now. I really hope this is the last time where I have to go through every single town because it always takes like half a day or something. Uh, and I haven't challenged a few people yet because I didn't want to overlevel Oberic that much. I wanted to bring some of my wife's favorite flowers to her grave, but it seems like they don't grow around here anymore. They're called Mind Me Always. There you go. Oh, kind of ironic that we are Alfin. This is a mind me always. My wife loved these best of all. Thank you. Melissa. Melissa, I'm home at last. Remember how much you love mind me always blossoms? I trust a handful of these at you when I proposed to you standing in that field outside the village. You took them and your smile was brighter than the sun. Not a day has ever passed when I didn't think of you. I've been wondering all this time, looking for a reason to keep on living. What is going on up there? Can you hear that? Like a quick question. Can you hear that? it's like someone is like choking or something like every single day and i'm not even trying to like <laughs> every day ah german curse words <laughs> like every single day and i'm not even trying to get a point across i mean literally every single day every, every time i'm around 20 20 21 o'clock i don't know and i don't know how pm and am works i I looked that up like every single time, but I always forget it works different here in Germany. So yeah. Anyway, I've been wondering all this time, looking for a reason to keep you on living. And I think I finally found it. I'm gonna keep on holding people as an apothecary for a little while yet. So I won't be coming to join you as soon as I thought I might. I hope you watch over me and wait for me to come to you. One more thing. There's someone I'd like to introduce you someday. I hope you won't mind if I bring him by here. I'm standing <laughs> right next to you. He's the one who reminded me that what it literally what it really means to be an apothecary. But there we go. Double tomahawk. I just recently stole one of those. So yeah. Up. Okay. I think it does like, like it attacks twice or something like that. Oh yeah, I think that one is new, right? Let me just look. Battle tested X. I got this from someone called Net in Victor's Hollow. I bought it. I bought quite a few things actually from some NPCs, and yeah, uh, I got a forbidden spear. In query quest for my for my uh, guarded house, it said <laughs> bought a forbidden spear inside a guarded house in query quest. So yeah, someone inside of a guarded house, and yeah, I got a forbidden spear, which I think gives like minus minus uh, speed, but a lot of damage, maybe I don't know, and I got a. I bought a battle-tested blade from Erhard in Wellspring, which is, I think, not good. No, Obrick has one. All right, yeah, it does. <laughs> it actually is really good, and I gave it to Obrick. That's good. All right, so much for that. Let me cross that off so that I don't bring that up like in the next part or something. Okay, next one would be Star of the Stage, which I don't know how to complete yet. Uh, yeah, start off the stage. I have to find our fence. 
I could swear there was a fencing instructor somewhere, but he's not inside a town because I checked every town. So I have to walk around the world to find him because I could swear there was a fencing instructor NPC somewhere. I don't, I just don't know where it is. Okay, the adventuring life. Um, yeah, I know to do that. I have to go to Atlas them. Uh, at yeah, it's this one guy who who needs uh who is like screaming around like I'm the chosen one, and yeah, this one woman asked us to bring someone who could keep uh, keep this idiot safe, and yeah, I found someone who's willing to do that no. up here. Ever since I read a book about knights, I've dreamt of becoming a noble knight squire. God, I love knights, don't you? Their fancy armor and jaunty plumes are topped uh, on their heads. All I need to do now is find one need of a squire. And yeah, this is the one. I checked. So yeah. Uh, where do I have to go? I think it was like quarry quest. Riverford. No, that's where I got the quest from. Oh, dang it. I think it was in Quarry Quest, right? Oh, all well. All well, yeah. <clears throat> uh, let me just check some things. I don't want to. Perfect. But I don't want any battles to interrupt me right now. This is a battle free part. <laughs> We're not gonna do any battles in this game. <laughs> At least not in this part. Yeah, let me just save. Because I don't know. <laughs> what if the game like crashes or something? Stuff like that could happen. Maybe. Or the console explodes. I don't know. <laughs> and you have something to steal. Rune hatchet, give me that. Give me that. <laughs> and here, have a night. A squire, I mean. Well, be with you, Trevor. Do you have business with Cavans, the chosen knight? Crivens, you're just like one of them knights from my storybooks. Indeed, lad, quite right. Begging your pardon, Sir Knight, but could I be your squire? It's always been my dream to serve a gallant knight such as yourself, sir, and travel the world. Ho ho, this is a fine coincidence, for I, the chosen knight, I am indeed a traveling the world. Very well, you may accompany me as my squire. Truly? I have been growing tired of my sol solitary path of late a journey shirt is a little is all better for it thank you sir now let us set about my lawyer squire the legend of the chosen knight begins today yes sir your lordship wasn't he just like someone who stole like some kind of armor or something or put on some armor and then <laughs> went off wasn't that why this woman was like worried and gave us this quest? Okay, Kaya, man of dragons. Uh, okay, I have it crossed off as something that I com can complete, but I can't complete. I I can theoretically I can complete. I have to go to a level fifty dungeon to do that, which is Dragon Song Fane, which was level fifty. But yeah, I can't. I am not planning on completing that now, so let's go to the next one, which is into fan air. Okay, <laughs> similar. I know what to do. I found Ellie. It's it's behind. She is behind that plant boss that I died to. So yeah, I can theoretically complete this, but yeah. Well, seek of knowledge. I know how to complete this one. And it should be the last one, yeah. And yeah, boy, was that? <laughs> I don't know where where was she again? Ah, dang it! Uh, 
cobblestone so yeah um the thing about her was i was never sure where to go to with her and i decided to go and she's looking for like some kind of proof from king beowulf some kind of relic or monument or whatever and yeah i figured since i was able to do this quest like in chapter one back then that i just have to go through every single dungeon and yeah eventually i would find some place where she was and yeah i started from here because cobblestone and yeah what do you know the first dungeon that i visited was actually the dungeon where i had to go i could so slap myself yeah and that was kind of annoying i was prepared to go through like the whole world but literally around the corner was where i had to go and yeah and i remember back there was something in that dungeon that i could like look at but yeah couldn't remember where it was and i didn't thought about that when i took that quest so yeah now it kind of makes sense all right um now please tell me i don't have to go what the I have to. First time I went to this one, to this area, I was already going the wrong path again. Now I'm going the path, the wrong path, one more time. Okay, I already got like I don't know, like a hint, well not a hint, but. I got told that I should go somewhere. I don't know where, and I don't want to know right now. But yeah, it's like some kind of thing that I have to find or something that I have to examine somewhere where I was, where I'm never supposed to go back to ever. And yeah, I don't know. I don't I, I'm not worrying about that because yeah there, that's I have my whole list is full with things that I can still do right now so yeah I'm quite busy for a few parts so when the time is right I will do that but yeah I will do that eventually like it's not gonna run away so yeah first of all I'm just gonna do all the things that I can do there's still a lot more quests that I can take right now and a lot of dungeons that i can visit i have to find like to get uh the last jobs and all that and yeah there's so much still going on and i will focus on that when the time comes because i'm quite busy right now in this game so yeah don't worry this this game will not be over until i complete like n at least 99 percent of it so yeah don't worry I will do it when time comes. Anyway, look over there. What? Ooh. And yeah, we found this thing like ages ago. Of course, I don't remember that thing from back then. I would have not thought to search here, and yet this erection is unquestionably ancient. <laughs> Let me just scrap off the smalls. Excuse me. An inscription in High Hornborgian. Luckily, I am well versed in the tongue. Well, I. According to this, the ancient realm of Farin once stood over the these lands. And what's more, it says that the second prince of Farin was none other than May named Beowulf. It goes on to say that Farin joined forces with the knights adante in a war against the rival realm prince beowulf led the combined armies to victory on behalf of his king as a reward for his great deeds in battle he was bequeathed the conquered lands so it was that he founded the kingdom of hornburg 
whose gallant knights would protect these lands for ages to come. This tale is exactly what with the King Beowulf legend. Why it is proof that the great man was no move but living flesh and blood. This is the breakthrough I have sought for years. How can I ever thank you, friend? With money. I shall study this monument more closely and then take the greatest delight in exposing my colleagues as the obdurate fools that they are. If you will be continuing your journey in these lands, I am sure our paths will cross again. Till then, my friend. And that is what I am kind of worried about because she is like one of those quests that, like, that uh, goes on for a while, like well seek of knowledge one so that means there's no well, seek of knowledge two at least somewhere which means since i got this since i could complete this quest like ages ago she's probably somewhere around in some kind of town and i have to walk through every town again until i find her so yeah fun anyway uh, during my travels, I found some new quests. Let me just look where they are. Ripple Tide, nothing. Gold Shore, nothing. Grand Port. There are two quests in Grand Port. Let's go over there. I found quite a few quests, like 10 or something, I think. So, yeah. Like I said, we are going to be busy for a while. And if I don't find that one thing, that one scene, or whatever there still is in this game, some hidden things, then yeah, later. <laughs> like, there's still so much going that I need to do without, like, I don't need to concentrate on the, like, really hidden stuff right now. I can do that later someday. So yeah, let's focus on all those things that are in front of us right now. Like this quest, for example. That's like the daughter of this one which no she's no she's none no that's not noah oh no i do hope you're all right cordelia who was that again she has never left my letters unanswered for so long before i didn't know what else to do with myself so i came here i do hope that nothing is the matter yeah what do you want me to do No and I happened to become acquaintance when I summoned in town once. We spoke of everything and nothing. <laughs> it was all nonsense, really, but she listened to me every story with such delight. When the time came for me to return to my own lands, she begged me to write to her. We have exchanged letters ever since, yet recently I've I had no replies from her. It couldn't be that something has happened to her. No, I couldn't bear the thought. What do you want me to do? Like <laughs> Like they they give really vague ex explanations on what to do on some things. Like I know I know this girl, Noah <laughs> quest given. Like what am I supposed to do with that information? <laughs> okay, now I know that I probably have to bring a I don't know, maybe I need to Isn't that like the father? Maybe I need to bring the father. I don't know. I was hoping to switch my legs. Okay, maybe he knows something. I don't know. In the diaries, I hope you're chronically your days. A diary is a record of all holds in your heart, you know. Okay, I think I know what to do, actually. I've been keeping my diaries without fail for 70 years. I've got enough volumes to fill a whole library by now. I don't have much to write about these days, of course. Is there still anything for an old man to experience so freeing that it demands to be recorded in a diary? You quite clear your days. I a brother. Yeah, I found some people who I can steal some stuff from. Like diary, something about diaries. And yeah. Let me just uh, edit my little notes. Okay, noble card is the next one in the flatlands. That's the only thing in the flatlands. And yeah, there are two more quests as well. 
you see what i mean i'm i still have so many quests again and i forgot to check if that worked i just brought her father with me might as well try maybe she's going on an adventure like Tressa. no that doesn't work I don't know so yeah that's a quest that i don't know how to complete right now <laughs> like that's that's telling me nothing like whatever two more quests uh noble quests noble curd i mean uh yep only two more quests in here oh and they're in here yeah those two guys i don't know uh, i gotta sneeze so hard Yo. right now <laughs> all right oh it's those two guys ahoy there i miss us like a landlocked sailor miss the sea didn't you yeah. we'll be here on our official business got a delivery for you from the captain <laughs> took you long enough didn't it oh hey no control in the tights now is there <laughs> wait isn't that the bad guy research is a battlefield and in it we scholars are constantly fighting to conquer more territory i requested the materials that i need for my research from you to aid me in this war but it seems you fail to realize the urgency of the matter i don't believe i'll be requiring the services of your trading company ever again what you're yanking me chain ain't you matey chain. if it had only been matter of punctuality that would have been one thing but no why don't you go and ask that captain of yours for the reason Nani? you got a problem with the captain now mm. indeed that brute leon we know all about him coming around with the fearsome look on his face and demanding that innocent civilians hand over their money oh yeah that guy from trust story quit your filthy lies and if you dare deny him he runs you right through with his great poleaxe to think we were doing business with such a villain a villain you take the back you salty sleaze locks huh. everyone said the news by now how captain leon gave up on merchantry and returned to his old pirating ways oh boy <laughs> the captain would never That's right, he told us he changed his way. Make all the excuses you want. It doesn't change the fact that we won't be asking your company for so much as another pebble. You don't have to take that kind of abuse from the likes of you. Bunch of bookish buffons who ain't never done a day of real work in your lives. What was that? Hmm. You're not refusing to give us your business. We're refusing to take your business. Oh, but it's too good for you anyway. <laughs> good then. <laughs> yeah, good then. <laughs> Did I just walk in? <laughs> well, mommy and daddy were having a conversation. All right, you guys. Uh, you what do you have? Stuff. Just remember what those too much things so said. Here we come out of our way to bring him the things they wanted, and that's how they treat us. We don't need the custom of crutch buckets like that. What were those book brains going on about anyway? The cat would never do a thing like that. Girl, just wondering about it won't get us nowhere. Those ignorant ruffians, blading hard working scholars like us. This is why I never trust others. I want I wouldn't be fooled. I know the truth. I know the truth. And the truth is that Leon is back seeing money from the innocent. And that's my eyes were to seeing me, that man was surely a famous Captain Leon. And yeah, again, not completely clear what I have to do here. Never no has yet to arrive. I wonder what happened. Oh. Is there anything for an old man to 
all right they're just hinting at like stuff <gasps> okay i guess those counted as two quests unless i noted down that those two had a quest and someone else i don't know but i think i note them both down as separate quests travel banter i've got a question to ear is human one well, i've got a question are you good any good at writing letters letters can say i am talking's quicker i often write letters when i put in my thoughts to paper they become clear to me so uh do you believe them as well yes if there's someone i would have known my feelings i give the letters in person that's my device of you a letter is important you don't want some deaf fool losing on are you speaking from experience it's like this i kind of messed up once a long time ago oh i was still just a kid there was a girl in our village called mercedes what <laughs> me and her and my buddy Seth would play together from dawn to the dusk most days when Seth and i studied late into the night she'd bring us sweets she baked but then one day we found out she was going to be sent off to live with distant relatives yeah in atlas time way over to the other side of the middle sea she was going chances are we'd never seen her again how sad well Seth wrote her letter and he gave it to me said he was too shy to give it to her himself and asked me to deliver it for him turns out he was uh, sweet on mercedes haha the plot doth ticken <laughs> Of course, I said I deliver his letter. I was his best pal after all. So one on that day that Mercedes was living, I headed to her house. But there I found that her coachman had suddenly taken sick, and I was too ill to drive the cart. I gave him myself and some medicine, and after a while, he was back on his feet. You can imagine I was pretty chuffed with myself that I could help. But Mercedes looked so sad sitting up there on top of the cart. Thank you, she said, but why didn't Seth come to say goodbye? That was the last I saw of her. I headed back home, ruminating about this and that, but clean forgetting about Seth's letter. By the time I remembered, it was too late. Oh, though it's not. Somehow I'm not surprised. <laughs> so what did you do with the letter? I gave it back to Seth, with my apologies, along with some fish from the river. Taught me a good lesson, that little incident. Oh, what was that? Deliver your own letters. Words to live by. Just so. <laughs> so it was Seth's fault. <laughs> it was Seth's fault all along. <laughs> Is what you're saying? <laughs> what? Uh. So it wasn't really his. Okay, there's no quest here. All right. Um, so it wasn't really his fault then. <laughs> Flames Grace, the quest, I think, from Ophelia's sister. I always forget her name. Uh, maybe I can remember before I arrived there in the cathedral. Uh, I'm terrible with names, did I? <laughs> uh, sorry. But but that's also the same thing in real life. <laughs> I'm terrible with names in real life. I I need so long to remember people's names and connecting names with with faces. <laughs> okay. Boom. Perfect. No, I did not steal. And mm. wait, is that good? That's actually pretty good. Let me get Tressor for a moment. <laughs> uh, I think. Oh, damn it! I can't. I can't teleport to the beginning of of this town. Yeah, I'm terrible with names. I it always takes me ages to remember someone's name, even if someone introduced themselves like five times. It's horrible. I also can't remember names like, but okay, because I don't know. 
sometimes i meet like people that i met after like 10 years or something they're like hey what's up and i'm like hey who was this person again yeah, well, back in school there was like this one person who always like said hey what's up <laughs> and addressed me by name and thought hey daniel huh <laughs> every time like in school in like the hallway and i'm like hey and all these years i had no idea who that was i like what <laughs> who was this person <laughs> why does he know me do i know him <laughs> Liana. All right, and purchase. Oh, that's Bishop's staff. I think it's actually better than what she has, right? Nope. Oh, wait, it is. Increases light damage delve. See, that's another reason why to do those quests. Every quest makes us a little bit more powerful. Step by step. So, yeah. <laughs> We're getting more equipped for every battle that's coming up. All right, what's up? I'm afraid that the people in Whispermill still carry a great weight upon their hearts, and I'm partly to blame for that. <laughs> I lead them into madness together with that man who called himself a savior. I know that so many people are trying to recover from that experience and rebuild their lives. Demo. But but I still haven't done anything to atone for my crimes. I think I have to go back to Whisper Mill. Maybe maybe if I do then Yana and Elisa. Let's go to Whisper Mill then, I guess. See what's up there. What's good? Yeah. Please tell me she's somewhere here. That he, that she doesn't get like lost on the way here. Oh, there she is. And isn't that from like Cyrus story or I don't know. There's so many NPCs in this game. I <laughs> can't remember all of them. Did I, did I mention that I'm bad with names and faces? Hi. So they came again. They did. It is most vexum. Hi. Oh, I should introduce you. This is Eliza Woodward. My father once heard the night uh, Adante. But we don't know her. Pray don't mention it, Liana. The achievements are not my own. We came here to try to find out more about the ruins where that altar lay. Oh, but I know you. Oh, okay. <laughs> ah, dang it. First I was like, oh, who is that? And oh, we don't know it. That's good. And then she was like, oh, I know you. God dang it. <laughs> and imagine myself in like real life situations like that. Oh, but I know you. I did not realize that you were also acquaintance with Miss Liana. Well, if we all know one another, that makes things even easier. Never mind the niceties. This point is this. The point is this. I want to find out about more. I want to find out more about that altar where Matthias held his awful ceremony. Yes, we had even gathered together a goodly number of people to aid us in this venture. But someone doesn't want us to provisions have been ransacked and we meet with obstacles every step we take we've made no progress at all as a result it is truly a bother and i guess i have to go in there oh shit. i've been worse that some followers of the dark flame are still among us though they hide their identities and these things deep in the forest of purgation all right know what to do there i guess okay uh new quest in cathedral done nothing in flames grace still snow there's so many quests <laughs> so many quests so many 
if I get like really good stuff from each quest, then I should probably do all of them. Who are you? I stole some stuff from. It. Oh, you are. I don't know. <laughs> what am I to do with my life now? I wonder. I have my freedom now. No longer am I bound to sell my body to pay my way in the world. Oh, she's like from Primrose story. But no matter who I ask, I found no decent work. <laughs> the world is a cold place when one is alone. And this place is colder than any other. I'm sick of it. Mm. Now that I think about it, I've been trembling from one job to the next ever since I left the Aeselhart's employment. Everywhere I went, all I found were cold hearts and miserable work. <sighs> is there any warm place left in this world? Some warm-hearted master would let me do decent work once again okay such dreams are too grand for a tired old whore okay there's okay that was not too vague i can do something with that i don't know how to complete it but at least i get some informations uh victor's hollow and i think that's like the last quest we gotta accept in this part because this could go on for like an hour and i don't want it to be this long so yeah yeah it's this guy that's like the guy from from uh, uh, uh from that fortune teller right was in love with hanit hey are you okay uh, i like please forgive me i was attacked by banners and my goods were stolen hmm. i was supposed to deliver them to susana too Hmm. Never you mind that. I'll get them back. <laughs> like no information. Where are those bandits? Hmm. So I like gets ill from time to time. And those were the ingredients for a medicine. Why do I get those informations? <laughs> like after I get the quest, <laughs> I need to get them back right away. Why did this happen to me? I was in the middle of a delivery when all my goods were stolen. I want to fight back, but I didn't stand a chance against all those bandits. Where? Like, did I miss something? Where do I have to go then? Oh, what? One. <laughs> those were ingots. Uh, I need to get them back right away. Like, I guess somewhere around here. Like, <laughs> see what I mean? All right, uh, that's a new quest completed. Oh yeah, wait. Let's go to dusk dusk barrel. There's something I can steal, and there's a level sixty person in front of a house. In a house. Mm -hmm. That's the only things that are left in this town. Shut up. <gasps> okay, I guess this guy. Marvelous memento. Yeah, it's like a diary item. I guess that's what I need for this one diarist. I don't know. And yeah. Thank goodness that I note noted down all those things. Um there's also something to see a boulder for. Let's do that. Another another mission item, I think. Uh oh god who was it you Q of diaries writers block all right okay got two of those and i think there was another one somewhere okay i guess i ended in this part and yeah we got a quite a few things like a new weapon which is good a, a new dagger which is good so yeah with every quest we complete we get a little bit more powerful and that will help us for upcoming battles which is good i try not to over level i think level 55 is pretty pretty good maybe that plant boss that i stumbled across was just like i don't know really hard so yeah need more levels i don't know Maybe some other level 50 dungeon is easier. So yeah. But okay. And part right here. And 
I'll see you in the next part where we continue some quests because there are quite a lot of them left. So yeah, thanks for watching. If you like, a comment, or subscribe. That would be really nice for you. And bye bye.